things aren't what they used to be. Before all this, I'd be waking up in my apartment in New York City. The sounds of traffic, sirens echoing through the city, the wind rushing through the buildings, the sound of civilization. Now, it's just silence. Nothing but my own thoughts and the cold, rotting floorboards for a bed. Home is no longer a happy thought or a specific place I can recall. It's now simply whatever scrap of shelter or remnant of someone else's past I can seek refuge in, even if just for the night. I still remember the day it happened. It's been six years now. The screams, the chaos, people tearing each other apart. The day humanity woke up to a world on fire. No one really knows what happened. Whether it was the bombs, meteors, some uncontrollable force of nature. It happened so fast and everything just stopped. Billions died that day. The survivors started killing each other over whatever little resources were left. I can remember the day after the fire rained down. I was still alive. Just standing there, looking around, thinking, did that just happen? Nothing could have prepared us for this. I used to have a purpose, a job, people I loved and cared about. Not alone, motivated only by survival. And the thought that maybe one day I'll find another human being who hasn't succumbed to the madness that consumes this earth. So far, all I found is death. The tattered remains of happiness that once existed. Happiness is now nothing more than a faded memory. Yet, I still press on, day after day, wandering from city to city, seeing the ruins of civilization and constantly telling myself that I'll find something, something better. I have to find something better, something worth living for again. So I'll continue to search, looking for any hope that humanity has, searching for others who believe that this world can still be saved. I'm not giving up on us, not yet. <laughs>